Hey guys, Steve Welch here, BMW Toyota in Nashville. Um, had a question here, I'm gonna answer it very easily. So, um, the blind spot monitor on the CHR. Now, not every CHR has blind spot monitors, but the ones that do, it's very easy to turn them on and to turn them off. So, easy way to tell if you have a blind spot monitor or not, you'll see this right here, these two little cars in your mirror. If you do have the blind spot monitor, that will be there. Um, by the way, this is blue flame, if you're wondering what the color is. Um, and this is a used one, don't have a new one right now. Um, obviously most people know uh, about the chip shortage, so I don't have a new one right now, but I wanted to go ahead and answer that question. It's very, very easy to answer that question, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut this door here. Um, first off, how can you tell that your blind spot monitor is on? Right there, BSM. If you have BSM, blind spot monitor is actually engaged on your vehicle. Blind spot monitors are, you know, they, you'll get that indicator because how else are you supposed to know it's on if it's not already turned on? RCTA, which is right below it, that's rear cross traffic alert. That's part of your blind spot monitoring system. That's if you are gonna back up and if there's a vehicle, a bicycle, a person, uh, depending on how the system's set up, it can actually see all of those and can alert you with your blind spot monitor system that you have somebody that's about to cross behind you. Now, in order to um, set it, you're gonna come up here, all right? So you see up top, all right, watch this. I'm gonna go over and I'm just gonna keep going over until I see this gear, all right? I got that gear right there, all right? Now, if you scroll down, you're gonna see several different things here. Vehicle settings, meter settings. Um, this is your lane departure, pre-collision. BSM, blind spot monitor, right? I've scrolled down, I'm gonna hit that button and you'll see blind spot monitor, rear cross traffic. If you wanna shut off the blind spot monitor, shut that off. You'll notice the rear cross traffic shuts off with it, all right? Now, if I turn it back on, you'll hear the tone and you'll see the monitor light up, all right? Turn it off, turn it on, see how it lights up? All right, now, if you want it on, but you don't want rear cross traffic, you can shut the rear cross traffic alert off, all right? So if you don't want that for whatever reason, not sure why you wouldn't want it, but if you don't, you can shut it off. But that is a very easy way to turn on or off your blind spot monitor. Now I do want to show you, if you watch RCTA, shut off over here, turn back on over there. All right, blind spot monitor. Now both of those lights are off. So that is off. So remember when you're looking at your dash, a green light is a good light. So it's an informational light, it's giving you information. A blue light will do the same thing, like your bright lights giving you information. A red light is a, uh, it's basically you have to do something about it. So the park, that is your red light. They obviously want your parking brake off. So if you're gonna go drive, you wanna turn your parking brake off. Your, um, your airbag light would be in red. Um, also the seat belt, obviously you want that off. But like this one, this is the tire pressure light. That one is a, uh, it'll either, depend on who you talk to, it's either orange or yellow. I've heard people call it yellow before. Um, I always call them orange, but your orange lights are caution lights. So your check engine light, your um, that light, all of those lights that are different colors. Like when you first turn it on, you'll see all those pop up. Actually, let me turn the brake off. And once I turn this on, you'll see all these pre-collision system, the ABS system, check engine, all those things that can come on your steering. Those, those are all in yellow. So if we turn that, that again, you'll see some more lights. Boom. So you can see other things. So see your steering can be either in yellow or red. So there's different things. Brake, that can be up in red. So all of those things. So just make sure that you know that depending on the color of the light, is how severe the issue is and if you see bsm in uh, green obviously it's not an issue it's um the blind spot monitor so hopefully i've helped you guys out this is on the chr this is a 19 but it is no different in the other ones it's uh i mean it's realistically it's going to be the same in all of the line that goes up so steve watch being toyota in downtown nashville definitely like subscribe uh, once again, like I said, this was a question that I had, so I'm trying to answer those questions for you guys. Let me know if you have one of those questions that pop up. I'm more than happy to answer them for you, and usually I'll do it in, in the uh, form of a video here for you so that I can help other people with that as well. So Steve, watch me on Toyota. Like, subscribe. Appreciate everyone of you guys. Hope you have a great day. We'll talk to you soon.